About 20. 1981. I stumbled out of the helicopter, already beginning to sweat, and looked around at the lush forest, the wet leaves. The first task was genetic recovery. Acquiring Jurassic or Cretaceous amber, extracting preserved DNA, and reassembling the complete sequences. Bringing it up the well, we called it. Three Cray XMPs move more data faster than any computer center in the Americas. In 11 months, Site B became the most powerful genetics facility in the world. Whatever. About 15. 15. of species, the history of life on Earth is being methodically reversed. Fifteen or so. Thirteen. Eight shots. Five. The hunters landed on May 13th, 1997, deep in the island's southwest. Most of them had worked at my African parks for years. They never stood a chance. I spared no expense, permitted no failures. By 1983, we held 13 new patents. I was in high school then. Four, three, two, one. That's it. About 20. Seventeen. Empty.
15 or so. November 1983, test fertilization of an artificial ovum. My hand shook as I held the tiny eye drop. One drop, two drops, there. The genie was out of the bottle. The raptor took shape inside its egg and I watched it on the ultrasound monitor. It looked like a ghost or a puff of smoke. Well. I began to have my first inkling of the seriousness of our work. How deep the well was. This was life from 65 or 100 million years before mankind. I've really done it. This is not a normal situation. It looks like 12. Eight left. Eight shots.
feels full. Eight left. Eight left. One shot. 